Good morning, everybody. Um, I've decided to start my day off with Jesus. So if you want to join me every day on the days that I don't work, I will be having it here around 8 or so. <coughs> Excuse me. Still got a little bit of sore throat. And then the days that I do work, I work from 10 to 2. So the days that I do work, it'll probably be a little earlier. Which it might be around, I'm going to try to keep it around the same time. That way everybody can be able to vlog or hop on. <laughs> but anyways, um, our first one is going to be beginning 21. Your first steps with Jesus. And then it's a, um, a daily devotion, so we only do one a day. That's why I'm going to do them every morning. That way you can start your morning off with Jesus. And then I'm going to do, I'll probably do one at night. That way it depends on how crazy it is. Because when the girls come and start coming in, it's like loud and crazy. And there's no quiet at all. Trust me. I have teenagers. <laughs> All right, so our first one is, like I said, beginning 21, your first steps with Jesus. Devotional content. Okay, this is day one. I'm going to get pulled up here. And if any of y'all want to get this on your phone, it's called, it's the Version Bible. And this is where we're going to start with. I don't know if there you go. There you go. Okay, devotional content, relationship. From the beginning of human existence, God made it very clear we were created for communi communication with Him. And with each other, the Creator already knows you. He does, inside and out, and He loves you for who you are. There's no need for playing games, no pretending. You don't need to fake it with your Heavenly Father. You can be yourself even on your worst days. God sees the best in you because He sees you th through Jesus. When, because He sees you through Jesus. Sorry about that. When you try your best and fail, you're still loved, still forgiven. God wants you to know Him too. He wants you to hear His heart Feel his love, learn his ways, draw from his strength on difficult days and good ones every day and any day. He will never let you down. And that's true. God is always faithful. As you get to know him more, he'll make changes in your life. But you won't be losing out. You'll be learning to let go and make room for something new. And God will fill those empty spaces in your life with something bigger and better, more of Jesus. He's your friend, hero, savior. Get to know him as soon, and soon, sorry about that, and soon you will see that you lack for nothing. You're complete in Christ. Okay, now this is the scripture. Okay, and it is John 3. Let's see. John 3, 16 and 17. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Number 17. For God not for God not sent his son into the world to condemn the world, but that world through him might be saved. So, they're saying that God sent his son to earth to be crucified and to rise, be risen in three days to save us all. To save us all from our sins. God does not want us to go to hell. God wants us to go to heaven with him. And if we do go to hell, then we're choosing to because God gives us free will. God gives us free will and we can choose 
where we want to go. Like, yeah, the path to walk to God is not easy. I know this. <laughs> but it is worth it. In the end, it is worth it. No one wants to go to hell and burn in hell. No one wants to spend eternity in hell. Why would you want to gain this whole world and lose your soul just to spend eternity in hell where it's painful and everything when you could spend it in heaven and spend eternity with Jesus? All right, that's the end of um, the one for today. So, um, if you haven't subscribed yet, you can like and subscribe. I would really like that. Um, but I would like for everybody to have a blessed morning and stay safe if you're on your way to work or if you're getting ready to go out to go to work. Um, drive safe, wear your seatbelt, don't text and drive. Well, I will see you guys tomorrow morning. God bless.